On September 2nd, we conducted a full-scale test of a solid rocket booster like the pair that will help power our Space Launch System or SLS rocket and Orion spacecraft on Artemis missions to the moon. The two boosters will provide more than 75% of the thrust produced during the first two minutes of an Artemis launch. The launch of the Sentinel-6 Michael Freilich Earth Observing Satellite is targeted for November 10th from California's Vandenberg Air Force Base. This partnership between NASA and the European Space Agency will continue a decades-long global record of observing sea level rise from space. The largest ever study of glacial lakes used 30 years of NASA satellite data to find that the volume of these lakes worldwide has increased by about 50% since 1990 as glaciers melt and retreat due to climate change. The findings could help us determine hazards to communities downstream of these lakes, more accurately estimate sea level rise, and better understand how glacial meltwater is transported to ocean.